WBC boxing star Ryan Garcia has issued multiple apologies on Friday for his blatant racist comments which he used against black people, Jews, and also Muslims on a Twitter X space, which caused him to get quickly expelled from the World Boxing Council at this time when he has already been suspended for banned substances in his last fight against Devin Haney. The 25-year-old incited outrage on Thursday by saying, among other things, that he hates black people. And he went on further to say, hey, let's go bring George Floyd back to life and kill that black man again. And he did all this on a Twitter X space. The backlash that followed also even included his own parents who released a statement saying that they don't want to have nothing to do with the comments and he needs help because he has mental issues. At the time when Garcia was going on this racist comment rant, there was no, I'm going to apologize about it a day after he had to change his tune and he went on by saying that he would take all responsibility for his words before mentioning his own trauma and his substance abuse issues and his issues with black on black crime and oppositions of pedophilia which he was saying that when he was talking about the muslims and young girls that was only some of what he said because he continued to tweet over 19 tweets that day which totaled about 693 words using lines such as I'm expelled like if I went to the principal's office ha ha and in the hood everyone has said the n-word see that kind of stuff so even in his 20 minute apology it still made zero sense but you gotta wonder when you have people that talk racist comments whether they're on x spaces or any social media site you gotta wonder and whether it was substance abuse or alcohol and drugs involved what do we say in the black community a drunk speaks a sober mind so this is what he really felt. That's why he spoke it. Because think about liquid courage. That's all alcohol is. It's going to give him some courage. I'm going to say it. And he said it. But check this clip out and you'll see that the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. This is his father speaking at a post fight. And he's talking with Devin Hanley's father. And Listen how he speaks, and you'll see where he gets all this from. Now, how you gonna keep it real? You're a nappy now. head. These people are not who you who you guys think they are. These this guy is talking about nappy hair. What like how when and what in what world is that okay to talk about a black man's hair? Now, after being expelled from boxing, his promoter, which is Oscar De La Hoya, took to social media, and Oscar. De La Hoya had these choice words for his fighter, Ryan Garcia. He said, there is no room for hate or tolerance in my company, period. I condemn Ryan's words in the strongest terms possible. He went on to write, I see that he has apologized and that's a start, but it's only a start to earn back the trust and respect of those of us who have and continue to support him. We hope Ryan will use the time he has away from the sport to work through the issues he has publicly discussed. Basically, as a promoter, he said, I'm disgusted with you. I can have no dealings with you. So he's not going to deal with him, which he can't deal with him anyway because the WBC said, no, we're expelling him. You can't fight in our company because the company is a brand. No, you, you're making our brand look bad. So we're going to get rid of you. We have other fighters. And you're already 
were banned for illegal drugs. You're not even trustworthy as a person who competes. You don't want to even honestly compete. You want to get some enhancing drugs just to compete. So are you even really a true competitor? Or, in my humble pie, was it this punch right here oh, what a shot! that made him think about black people with those racist comments? This very punch right here <laughs> by yours truly is what made him say, I hate black people. Because this punch did something real serious to him. But with that people, nobody actually has room for racism. We have to just all coexist in this world, a place called humanity, right? If you don't like another group of people, you keep that to yourself. You don't deal with them. But you don't have to blurt out of your big mouth. And that goes for anybody. You don't have to blurt out of your big mouth a bunch of hateful things about people and especially people that have passed away. Like my grandma say, if you ain't got nothing good to say, don't say nothing at all. And with that, I'm going to say, this is the news in you. North, east, west, south. You're nine from every alley in Cali. In a section in back street, subscribe to the channel and hit the thumbs up on your way out the door. Star child, I never Never seen the sun shine like this I never Never seen the moon do like this Hey yo, I never Never seen the waterfalls like this I never Never seen